Good morning, everyone. Uh, I wanted to share a quick story with you. Uh, back when I was pretty young, I guess, fifth and sixth grade before going into middle school, I had to go to uh, summer school for extra help in regards to reading. I remember my parents got like hooked on phonics and you know it was just something that I struggled with a lot. I remember in and obviously didn't help that much in sixth grade I remember getting a 19 on a reading test. Uh, I just didn't read the book. I was struggled with reading for so long and it kind of went with me throughout a lot of even high school and the reason why I bring that up is because right now I'm reading at least a book a month, which is crazy because even growing up younger, my grandparents used to have to, you know, they would try to bribe me with like, if you read a book, you got like $5, uh, get some money, but um, you know, to this day, I'm still not motivated by money. So that didn't really work that much. But I feel like today, and now, and you know, it wasn't this like change that all of a sudden, you know, I, or, or that I've just been this reader. It was this big, cha it was this change. I made an effort to try and read more because I have the a massive amounts of, you know, knowledge that is out there that you can get. And, you know, I used to watch an absurd amount of TV, hours upon hours of TV. You know, in high school, I would go to bed late, um, you know, just watching TV all night even a few short years ago, would do the same thing, just like get home from work, immediately watching TV, same thing like staying up too late watching a movie, and and it's just, there's nothing wrong with watching some TV or watching a movie here and there, but to me there's just such a greater value in taking the chance to read a book. Now, um, a lot of the books obviously that I'm reading are more marketing related or self-development related, um, but there's a ton of books out there and a ton of options that you can choose from based on what you like. The, the reason I bring this up is because I just believe that, there, that you should be learning more. And so many people just get home and are just, you know, want to do mindless things, which, you know, is fine. I get it. You want to, you know, you get home from work, you maybe want to watch some TV. But how much TV are you then watching? How much mindless things are you doing after work? Are you like completely shut out? You know, and it doesn't have to be crazy. Maybe you just find some time here and there to just read a little more, learn a new skill, watch some YouTube videos on a new skill. Um, there's a there's a quote, and it says, "The person who can read and doesn't is no better than the person who can't read." So just something to think about. I hope that kind of encourages you to maybe listen to some audiobooks or just read a little bit more or just like cut back on the TV a little bit because that's really what you know this message I think is is more about because when I decided to do that it has made a dramatic change in my life in just eliminating TV from you know my daily routine not to say I don't watch TV ever um, you know but it's dramatically dramatically less and very minimal so I hope that helps. Uh, I hope you have a fantastic week, um, and I will talk to you soon, and let's keep growing together.